Hi, welcome to Rick Snyder's Washington on YouTube, where you get the whole story. So please like, share, subscribe, comment, and hit the thanks button. And an early Merry Christmas to everybody if I don't see you tomorrow. All right, so the Washington Commanders are going up to New York to play the Jets. Whoo, is anybody going to watch this game? <laughs> it's one o'clock on Sunday, so you can watch before you have to go to church on Christmas Eve if you want. Or parties or whatever. So they fit that in. But boy, the stands are going to have to be empty. It's a disappointing year for both teams. Aaron Rodgers is not going to play. Uh, he shouldn't play. That, was, that would have been a crazy thing to have done. Uh, <clears throat> but the Jets, they were having visions of maybe being a Super Bowl. And it kind of reminds you of the Commanders. Ryan Fitzgerald got hurt in the second quarter. Aaron Rodgers got hurt in the first drive of the season, tearing Achilles. So, you know, they, they've got a pretty good defense. And that's going to be tough on Washington. I expect... You know, the over-under is 37. Everybody's expecting a lower game. I think it'll go over. And you know what? I'm going to take Washington in this one just because it it just feels like counter to the t intuition. You think the Jets, they're at home, better defense. You know, Washington doesn't seem to care anymore. Playing out the string, you know, the coach is getting fired. Normally, uh, I would say you take the Jets in this. But boy, Washington just pops up with a win once in a blue moon, which is unfortunate because you don't want to get blue moons much. And I just have a feeling they're going to jump up and do this one. I might have started Jacoby Brissett in this one if you really wanted to win because Sam just seems to be uh, kind of winding down. And Sam Howell's got to play well in his last three games. And unfortunately, the next two are against San Francisco and Dallas. So there's no mercy there. And as defensively, the Jets are, you know, a top team too. So he's going to have to play well to maybe keep that job next year. There's so much of that. We're going to talk about it for five months, probably in the offseason, maybe more. But you need to see this. I don't know if we're going to get the running game going in this one. I don't know. It's going to be tough to watch. I'm Rick Snyder. Thanks for coming. I'll see you soon. I'll see you after the game.